All right, Gary, we're gonna go for a ride in a pretty cool uh, Italian, American, something or other sports car. German, everybody, <laughs> everybody jumped into this one. 1972, De Tommaso Pantera. These things uh, oh, yeah. lately have been great investment cars. I mean, they, they seem to be going up regardless of how original they are, just about how nice they are is kind of how the price comes into play. Uh, but this one's beautiful. It's got the, the wide uh, steel flares done many, many years ago, and uh, they're holding up great. The uh, paint's beautiful. Yep. It's like a nice, bright torch red. It's got a slightly newer interior. This is like a 74 interior. Better dash panel. Uh, real comfortable seats with the uh, the pleats in them, you know? Yeah, I, also, like, I love these cars. That is a neat car, you know? They got a 351 Cleveland. This one's been completely rebuilt. It's got some goodies in there for reliability. Updated cooling system, updated brake system. Yeah, uh, got the fluidine radiator. Yep, dual fans. It's all the stuff you kind of need to do to these if you want to drive one. Um, but of course, it's got all the original uh, gauges and everything under there, the gated shifter. Yeah, air conditioning that's cold. Yeah, actually, I forgot about like, that. How do you like that one? I'm used to saying the air doesn't work, but yeah, this one, I mean, the air works. And, and that's the truth in these cars. Yep, this even has the trunk in the back. We'll show you that. You, you can remove it and see that beautiful engine compartment. They even smoothed out the engine compartment inside and painted it to match the car. And I've known this car for myself for about 30 years and uh, belonged to a friend of mine. and. I finally pried it out of his hands. Yeah, that's a neat car, man. Yeah, it's a pretty, pretty cool car. Woo! We're yeah. gonna go up here. We'll I take think I'm just gonna buy it. No, okay, just, never mind. It's not for sale, guys. <laughs> Anyhow, we're gonna come up here, take some pictures, and show show it to you a little closer. All right, we like this one. Proud to present another 1972 De Tommaso Pantera. These are great cars. It's a performance car. You know, it's Italian design. 351 Ford engine in there. Uh, it's got a German uh, ZF five-speed transmission. It's gated. Um, just really cool car. You can stuff a bunch of tire under these things. This has the steel flares, like the GT Appearance Group, um, that have been updated ba way back in the day. But this is a two-owner California car since new, which is really good on Panteras because these things are prone to rust. The floors get rusty. A lot of areas, the suspension components get rusty. Not this one. This is a beautiful car. Uh, it's got these uh, upgraded... Uh, three-piece alloys on there with the big brakes. What kind of tires are on there? It's Michelin's. I think the big ones are like steamrollers back here too. 335 3018's. Pretty cool looking wheels and tires. Interior wise beautiful. Um, we just uh, had a new headliner put in it. New windshield. Just a few little things to clean it up a little bit. The car was kind of been sitting for years, and uh, I think I mentioned earlier, it belonged to a friend of mine. I've known this car for 30 years. He's going to be upset when he sees it all finished and never really got a chance to use it and drive it. But he can come by for a spin if he wants to. Got the supple leather interior, slightly modernized interior. It's got a 74 uh, dash and console. Um, there's no radio in there, but we can leave that up to you. I'm going to put some tunes in it. To me, I like to listen to the motor right behind your neck. 400 horsepower of screaming Ford motor, but really clean, nice paint. It's got a couple little imperfections in it. You know, it paint's 30 years old. It's got a little dimple here in the in the fender, a little dent there. You can even hard to see actually out here. You can see it when you're inside though. It's got the sport mirrors, but they kept it pretty simple. No giant wings or anything crazy on it. No front air dam. Just has a really clean, simple look, and it's a beast. Fun car to drive. Here's the beast of a power plant in the De Tommaso Pantera. Uh, it's a 351 Cleveland. This is the original motor for this car too. It has been upgraded though. It's got a aluminum intake and headers and a lot of polished goodies on there. Double pumper Holly carburetor. Uh, it's got roller rockers. Just all the things that make it a little bit more reliable. Also has an MSD ignition. It's got the better one there too, if you can see it back there. It's a black off-road edition. It handles a little bit more abuse and heat. Um, but a lot of shiny stuff under here. This engine compartment is beautiful. These are usually like a black, rhino line kind of ugly uh, engine compartment. And of course, there's a trunk that lays in here too, which we showed you in the pictures. But, uh, you know, even the bell housing is polished and the transmission works great. It's a ZF uh, six speed transmission. There's the air conditioning condenser. Air blows cold, uh, really fresh, newer compressor, pretty clean. We're going to go ahead and fire this one up for you. Yeah, 
Pantera. I don't even have to walk around the back because I'm already around the back. Listen to those pipes. Yeah, so, that sounds awesome, man. Well, if you want to see this car in person, you come out and see us at California Cars. We're at 2158 Union Place in the city of Simi Valley, California. Phone number here is 818-591-1313. You can speak to myself, Rich, or Gary. Gary would be more than happy to take you for a ride in this one. And uh, we appreciate you watching.